I'll show you two set of pictures. The first picture for the first group of them will show you how Harry is being lectured, how he became so dependent on Meghan Markle and his aides for his success. The second set of pictures, I'll show you how they're faking it. Meghan Markle, Prince Harry, they were not like this before. So let's talk about this. Welcome back to my channel. One more time, if you're somebody new to this channel, consider to subscribe because we talk about the British royal family in this channel. So again, consider to subscribe. So first video uh, or first set of pictures, I should say, I want to show you this one. As you can see, Meghan Markle and Prince Harry, they are entering the UN, okay, when they were giving the speech. Prince Harry was going to give the speech. This is the picture. So they were looking very happy positive which is good now let's take a look at the next uh, picture because the next picture is going to be a little bit more interesting so let's take a look at the second picture here's the second picture and as you can see here in this picture prince harry is being lectured okay this is where they're sitting uh, this is where Meghan markle is somewhere right here and prince harry is almost like hiding here uh, and there is one gentleman sitting here and there is a woman a lady sitting here uh, this other picture will show you a much more clear um, of the image. So let's uh, take a look at the next one. If you take a look at this one. So as you can see, the lady, she is giving uh, them uh, some kind of tips. Or I do not know who she is exactly, but it looks like uh, she was there to give them some advice to prepare Prince Harry for the speech. And this is the lady, Meghan Markle again. She is here. And as you can see, Prince Harry right here is hiding. And this person, this individual is also there. Uh, looks like they're again giving them some tips some ideas some clues as to how to prepare for the uh, speech at the UN uh, the very next day and let's take a look at this um, pictures Th this is the picture where they were sitting this is the same hotel they spent when one reporter say thirteen thousand dollar for one night but um, regardless of what it is uh, they are Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, they are very, very expensive. Wherever they go, as I said in the past, they are celebrity. They're li living a standard of celebrity life. So let's go back at these two pictures that I showed you in the beginning. Why I showed you the first set of these pictures, of the, these three pictures, the first three pictures, it shows that Prince Harry, he had to be advised. He had to depend on these people, as I said and uh, pointed out, uh, for his uh, success. So they are there uh, giving him some serious, serious advice and Prince Harry, as you can see, almost hiding. Um, as an alpha male, you are supposed to be taking the leading role. You need to be the, at the forefront, but we see the exact opposite when it comes to Prince Harry. He is sitting at the back, he is depending on Meghan Markle's assurance, he is depending on how people are going to help him for his success. So these two individuals, they are sitting at the front doesn't look good on prince harry because even though this picture was taken from an angle where prince harry was you know uh, behind these people uh, behind this one individual but nevertheless it is still shows prince harry was not in control of the situation he was not somebody who was sharing his skill or sharing his thoughts rather he was being shared by these two individuals so let's take a look at the second set of pictures that i i told you if you take a look at the um, second set of pictures, you can clearly see another uh, very interesting uh, uh, thing about Mega Marco Pensari. So let's take a look at this. This is from the UN, and uh, we have all noticed how they were uh, holding hands, uh, especially Mega Marco. She was like, "Yeah, I cannot let your hand um, go off of me. I need to hold you tight. I need to reassure you. I need to talk to you. You need to feel comfortable with me." Blah blah blah. And this is something we see these days very often: kissing, hugging, smiling, doing it too much. These pictures, these videos are anything but normal. Why I'm saying this? Let's take a look at these other pictures. Then you will know what I'm talking about. So if you go to this one. Uh, so again, this is again uh, at UN. As you can see here, uh, they're holding hands. Um, Meghan Markle is like, uh, you know, playing a very important role. <laughs> Even though I don't think she was doing anything to make things better for Prince Harry. It was actually getting even worse. But nevertheless again holding hands that's the point right and if you take at this 
old pictures uh, go back here you can see they're not holding hands these are all from their previous years um, public attendance we do not see them holding hands the way they do these days <laughs> let's take a look at their hand here Meghan Markle is keeping her hand off of Harry and, uh, and Harry is also uh, keeping his hand off of Meghan Markle there isn't really no need for a uh, you know to, to fake it and this is what we have seen when they were newly wed things have changed and I want to show you one more picture here uh, as you can see this one again uh, they're not holding hands rather they are actually keeping a distance and this is how Prince Harry should behave and again Meghan Markle not holding hand of Prince Harry but as if you go back to all the pictures that I showed you recent pictures at the UN uh, the Invictus game you see uh, Mega Marco Prince Harry they are putting up a show you know um, as if they're telling the rest of the world that you guys are saying so many things about us but we are actually living a very happy life we have no problem whatsoever so these are some of the pictures that I wanted to show you to show you the con the con you know the, the, the contrast um, of these two couples uh, now and then and you will see in the future I have predicted that Meghan Markle will be doing a lot more than what she has done in order to keep Harry on her side. She cannot afford Harry to lose interest in her, um, not at the moment, but when the right time will come, Meghan will do another exit from Prince Harry. Thank you guys for tuning in, for joining. I'll see you in the next video.